Five design classics you might not have expected to come from Germany. Walter Gropius' name is inseparable from the Bauhaus Art School he founded in 1919 in Weimar. Gropius became a world-famous architect, but his last work wasn't a building. It was a tea set he designed for the Rosenthal Porcelain Company. Gropius designed with the principle of form follows function. The fifth spot on a list of German design classics, the TAC-1 tea set. It went into production in 1969 and is still sold today. What's striking about this classic is its ingenious simplicity, a shelf without screws that can expand together with its owner's book collection. In fifth place on our list of design classics that come from Germany, the FNP shelf system. It only takes 15 minutes and no tools to assemble. The parts are joined by aluminum rails. The first one produced in 1989 was the brainchild of the carpenter Axel Kufus. Since then, he's made over 50 kilometers worth of shelf racks. Club chairs have been well cushioned right from the start. But designer Marcel Breuer set out to break with every tradition. His club chairs, made of steel tubing, are now seen as icons of the industrial look. In third place on our list, the B3 club chair. The idea was to make it a purely functional object for daily use. But like all Bauhaus design classics, it was quite pricey when it first appeared, and still is today. This lamp has even made it into New York City's Museum of Modern Art. Pundits say what's special about it is that nothing special about it. The second spot on our list of design classics from Germany is by German silversmith Wilhelm Wagenfeld, the WG24 table lamp. At first he only made 50 of them and sales were sluggish. In 1980 they were revived according to Wilhelm Wagenfeld's original plans and this time they took off, becoming a worldwide bestseller. This classic Vienna coffeehouse chair has been turned out more often than any other model. It's been produced for a century and a half in Frankenberg, Hesse. In the top spot of design classics you might not have expected to come from Germany is the Tonet chair number 14. In 1859, it was a design revolution. The beechwood is heated in steam for five hours to make it pliable. The Tonet family company has kept the process unchanged to the present day.